If you like what I make and want to help out the channel, make sure you subscribe to it, turn on notifications, leave a like on the video below and comment as well. Thanks for your support guys. Hey there YouTube, welcome back to the Gecko. Another day, another video for you guys. And this one is all about the brand new champion pack that came out. It has 25 more chests than the previous one champion chests and a ton of brand new other monster chests, I guess, which include all the other monsters with the exception of the Tidal Titan, the Bon Appetit and Quinn B chests. And of course you never get any hunter chests with any package except for the actual hunter packs. Overall, it's a nice increase. It's still a lot of money, $100 for a pack. And of course, the brand new set is also very expensive. Of course, there's backwards compatibility, meaning if you had parts from the previous champion packages, you can use them to get brand new champion pieces. Let's go look at the first couple of pieces of gear we have, and we're going to compare them to the old one. The first piece we're going to look at is the sword, which gained 20% infantry attack and 20% range attack and lost 35% cavalry attack, which is a total gain of 5%, which is pretty good. The next piece we're going to look at is the lamp, which gained about 5% infantry attack and brand new 30% cavalry attack, but lost 35% range attack, which keeps it even. The helmet gained 25% infantry attack and 25% range attack. However, it lost 15% army max HP and 30% cavalry attack, but it's still an overall increase of 5%. While the chest piece did gain 10% army attack and 30% infantry attack, it actually lost 35% range attack, 7.5% army defense, and 10% max army HP, losing 12.5% overall. The legs piece exchanged its infantry attack for cavalry attack, staying even at 40%. And finally, the accessory replaced its infantry attack with ranged attack, staying even at 15. What you're going to see on the screen right now is an Excel sheet that I made with all the parts and all the pieces and everything it gives out. So essentially, what you're seeing is that technically, technically, the old set still gives you about 2.5% more overall buffs. Since the sword and the helmet of the brand new champion pack gives you about 5% more overall, but the old chest piece still gives about 12.5% more, so you end up with about 2.5% overall more. However, the whole point of this is to give a diversity to the champion pieces that you can use in order to maximize attacks and like, it's not that everyone who has gold champion set is now the same. Pretty much what this means is that if you want to do like a heavy range attack, all you have to do is use, let's say, the old gear and just swap the sword and the helmet and you'll have much more range attack. If you want to do a heavy cavalry attack, you only swap the lamp and the legs. So now there's a little bit of a dynamic way to actually be able to counter new with the new champion set, the old champion set. So now it's kind of a mix where you would have to have a little bit of everything in order to be able to counter, which is, I guess, what IGG was going for. At this point, people had a full gold set of champion with all the jewels and all that. They'd be pretty much equal and the only difference would be really who has Emperor gear and who doesn't. There were ways to like counter a little bit the champion with uh, using the Mecha Trojan uh, chest piece, which I think is like a firewall plate, which gave you a ton of cavalry attack and a ton of infantry attack too, which is how people kind of worked around being able to not have the, the chest piece, but still have a very good chest piece. Overall, again, super expensive to get, super expensive to get to gold. I would not touch it with a 10 foot pole, but as you guys saw and probably will be seeing again, a couple of people already have some gold pieces. I will be probably doing a better analysis in a different video or even on live stream because it's not worth the video of what would be the best parts of each to get. But for now, that's all I have for you guys today. I just wanted to show you the brand new parts, show you that some people already got the new champion parts and are already working out on how to get the best bang for your buck and be the strongest. If you guys want, you're welcome to pause the video at any time in the past couple of minutes where we're looking just at this Excel sheet and you can see that you have all the stats right here, everything that you get. And uh, yeah, that's everything I wanted to show you. Thank you very much for watching the video. Thank you very much for all your support, all your likes, all the everything. The sheer fact that there's people out there hating on me just goes to show that we made an impact. So thank you for that. And until the next time, I'm out of here. See ya.